All right, good morning everyone and welcome back to another vlog. I, I'm having a time this morning. I just feel kind of sluggish and out of it and just like moving really slow and that is not what I want today to be. So trying to balance like being gentle with myself and like motivating myself, kicking it into gear, getting productive. So I was working on the couch in my pajamas for the past hour or so. And I was like, you know what? If I if I want to feel better, I don't think this is helping. I, I should get up. I should shower. I should make myself feel ready and refreshed and set myself up for success. So that is what we're doing. I washed my hair, put on some real clothes. I'm putting on a little bit of makeup. And we are going to make today a good day. At least we're gonna try with uh, the things that I am in control of. <sighs> Drinking water. I woke up feeling like a little tired, you know, I feel like I'm always kind of tired right now, but pretty good. And then I threw up, which you would think I would be past that point in pregnancy now, I'm 26 weeks, but I still deal with nausea in the morning sometimes, like maybe once or twice a week, I'll just randomly get sick and like the smallest things can trigger it. And from there it was a little downhill. But like I said, I really, I want today to be a good day. It's actually my first day like fully back in office and working. I have childcare, Grace is with her nanny today. Jaden and Jess and Kenzie are working in office. I'm like, this uh, this is gonna be a fun day. And all, all is not lost. It's only 9.30. I feel like I was kind of getting in the mindset already that like today was shot. But like, let's, let's turn it around. Eyebrow gel, this tube is like almost out. Like I'm really, really scraping here. We still got some pigment. I have a report placement tube right here. I just like, I don't want to abandon this one too soon because it's a pretty expensive product. It's the Glossier Boy Brow. I was going to hold it up so you could see the label, but I've used it so much that the label has like pretty much entirely rubbed off. It's a great eyebrow gel though. And I feel like it lasts a while. I get my money's worth. I'm feeling like more of a human already. <laughs> My lips have been really chapped lately from the weather. So instead of like a regular lip gloss, I'm using this Patchology Lip Service Treatment Balm. And I feel like it gives a, a glossy finish anyways. All right, is there anything else I wanna do? Spritz of perfume. I'll take my hair out of the towel. T-shirt, I mean. Okay, this is the fit for today. I wanted loose and comfy, but not pajamas. So this is what we landed on. Um, both of these pieces are actually brand new. I just got them in an upcoming Schultze Collective video that you'll see. They're both um, from Old Navy's maternity line. So we've got the over the belly maternity jeans and then this cute like waffle knit oversized uh, little pink sweater in my color palette a year later since the uh, color analysis video. Almost year and it still like really has an effect on my wardrobe and like what I'm drawn to. But yeah, main goal with this fit was again to contribute to me feeling like a human being. And I think it does that. More water, more water, more water. I'm gonna make a smoothie before I head upstairs. This is a frozen fruit mix. A little more than I intended, but that's all right. Grace wanted some too, so some spinach. Pack that in. Some yogurt. Why? Uh, I think it helps make it creamy, and I like that it adds protein. Eat the banana. You want to eat the banana? Well, I'm only going to use half. Would you like the other half? The other half. Yeah. You have the other half. You're welcome. I'm going to put some water in here too, and then we'll blend it up. Okay, you ready? It's going to be a little loud. That's a good looking smoothie. And it tastes good too. Would you like yours? It's delicious. It's a green smoothie. It's green like... Oogie boogie! <laughs> I was gonna say green like grass, but green like oogie boogie is really good too. And Ariel's tail. And Ariel's tail is green. I just caught a like glimpse of myself in the camera and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so pregnant. Good morning. I am exactly like other girls. <laughs> the times have changed. <laughs> All right, I am about an hour and a half into work and I feel so much better. Oh my gosh. I think part of it is, you know, like the 
the getting ready, getting into the routine, but also the girls are here now. Can I pan to you guys? Hello. Jess and Jaden and Kenzie. And their energy just always brings me up when we're doing like some really fun creative brainstorming for some upcoming Schultzy Collective videos. The vibes are just good and uh, I feel it bringing me up. I've been pretty productive getting through some of the to-do list things. We just confirmed our first sponsor of the year, a sponsor we had been negotiating with for a February Schultzy Collective video. So things are just things are going good. We have a meeting um, in a little bit here for one of the videos we were brainstorming for. Um, we're going to be recreating some Pinterest photo ideas. So we were like going through all of the ones we had pulled separately and figuring out what direction do we want the video to go. The more unhinged photos, the more artistic. And there are some really good ones we have to choose from. Um, and then we have a meeting a little bit later with Rachel to bring her in on that brainstorming and just kind of like flesh out what the video um, is going to look like and how it's going to be structured. We usually do these like pre-production calls like a month before the shoot and that's just like going over the big picture idea and sourcing things and we'll do another call like a week or a couple days before the shoot where it's like the nitty-gritty the logistics um but we're a little bit more behind on our schedule than usual just doing like some January catch-up so we're actually shooting this video in two and a half weeks so timeline's a little bit more crunched but I think we're, we're in a really good place with like the brainstorming and the the creative so everything can now kind of fall into place after this meeting. So we're feeling good. We're gonna keep this going, keeping up with my water intake. I drank my smoothie and took my Ritual Prenatal, who is sponsoring today's vlog. Oh, I'm gonna get, uh, get comfy on the floor real quick while I tell you about our sponsor. I've been sitting in a chair for too long. So Ritual is having a limited time New Year's sale. You can get 40% off all of Ritual's clean, traceable, and science-backed products. This is one of the highest offers I've seen from Ritual, so it's a great time to buy if you've been wanting to try and build simple daily habits in the new year. I switched over to Ritual to simplify my vitamin routine, and it's been great. Ritual's prenatal helps support nutrient needs before and during pregnancy, so if you're thinking about trying or you're trying or already growing that baby. Check out their next generation prenatal. It is high quality and OBGYN approved with 12 key nutrients for before and during pregnancy, like folate, of course. It also has a vegan omega-3 to support fetal brain development, vitamin D3, K2, and magnesium for bone health. They're vegan friendly, gluten-free, non-GMO, and free of major allergens without extras or artificial colors. And and I think my favorite part of it is just how gentle it is on your stomach. They have a delayed release capsule design. You can take them with or without food. And they have a really nice either lemon or mint smell, minus the lemon. Very easy to take and super convenient. The essential prenatal is just two capsules daily and comes delivered straight to your door. So you never have to worry about running low. And if you don't love your ritual after 30 days, they will refund your money, no questions asked. Rituals limited time for 40% off sale is running now. You can click the link below and use our code SierraSteven40 to access it. That's 40% off site-wide. Rituals prenatal is usually $39. Right now it's only $23.40 with our code. So thank you so much to Ritual. Check them out. 40% off your order with our code SierraSteven40. Now I was gonna get up and go back to my desk, but I kind of want to, oh, just stretch it out. Feels kind of nice just like leaning on the couch like this. Probably looks ridiculous, but what I would give for a prenatal massage, oh my gosh. You know what's one pregnancy thing that is cut out of the vlog so much? All of my just like grunts and groans right now. I feel like I'm always just like, huh, uh, and then breathing really heavy, especially when I come up and down the stairs. It's like when I'm not pregnant, we're cutting out lots of ums and uhs. Pregnant, we're just cutting my breathing and my grunting. Okay, while I was doing that, I downloaded the next Schultze Collective video that Rachel sent me for review. The first draft of the video I was talking about this morning where I got these new maternity clothes. So I am gonna watch that back, send some notes, and then uh, we've got our meeting. Maternity hall time. So I'm currently 24 weeks pregnant. Dang, my hair looks good in this video. <laughs> Just thinking that. I'm like, what did I do to my, oh, this was like right after my haircut. 
Yeah. We also got a bunch of the video and audio issues that we were having figured out before this shoot. And oh my gosh, this video just looks and sounds so much better. I'm so happy. Just logistically, because this is kind of coming up faster than I think we all- And then um, I just confirmed the sponsor details this morning. So we can place those outfit orders as soon as we have the photos confirmed. Oh my God. They're good, right? Yeah, these are great. Okay. They're horrible, but they'll be yeah. good for the video. <laughs> but yeah, so that's, that's, the, that's, the, that's the vibe. Ruben is coming down to shoot this, so I want to have like a good idea of like what your schedule is going to be. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I picture this like you guys are all on the couch chatting, chatting, honestly kind of really similar to the Kendall Jenner video, like chatting yeah. about <laughs> the crazy Pinterest photos you guys like had fun finding and whatever thoughts you have on Pinterest. Sierra goes, I picked this photo, boom, we go to Sierra's photo shoot, boom, we come back, Jaden and then Kenzie, and then, you know, in that order, and then the group, and then, and then we do all the reactions at the end, and then we end the video. Like, I think, structure-wise, pretty simple. Okay, meeting was good. Also, Jaden and I have some other, we got some other exciting news today. We got some today. exciting news. Our siblings got Disney Pop. Ah! I'm so excited. We've been, like peer pressuring them into this for so long. At least a year. And you were the one who got to the front of the queue first for them, I huh? did, yeah. We had it up on, I think, four different screens. Oh my and gosh. And I was the one that got first. I was like, let me, I can do it. I can do it for you guys. I'm so excited. We're all Thank going you. next week yeah. for my birthday. And mm -hmm. I, oh, I'm so happy. I like squeal about it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're planning a little girls' day with us and Bethany and Grace. No, yep. I gotta gotta figure out what day we want to do that. I know everything's so busy, but I'm like, I know I want to do it soon too because I'm like, I don't know how much longer I'm gonna be able to walk around Disney. You're so right, <laughs> but yeah, very exciting. So exciting. see, it is a good day. It is. It is. See, it's okay. It's okay. Hey. It's okay. It starts crying. Yeah, it's, it's, it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> Throws up. <laughs> it is a little after four now, and it's been a, a surprisingly productive positive day considering how I was feeling when I started this vlog. Um, but everyone just left for the day and I just finished one of my last things on the to-do list today, which was to place orders for a video we're doing where we're buying from TikTok shop and testing those products. So I've been screen recording like every single video I've seen with the TikTok shop link for the past couple days, literally 85 screen recordings, 85. So I just placed orders for uh, the two that I saw the most, which were the crop tuck, which is like a way to make, you know, tops look like they're cropped when they're really not. And this like heated round brush thing. So excited to try those in the Schultze Collective video. And I'm actually gonna film a clip for that now, talking through like the ads that I saw and what I ended up buying. So I just set the camera up here for that. And I figured I should probably update you guys too, cause today's vlog has been a little sporadic. Um, I'm gonna pin back my front piece is here. Do I need a real mirror or can I get away with just the viewfinder? It's pretty cute. Some lip balm. I think I'm gonna bring a light out here too. It's just getting a little dim and the sun sets pretty soon. So then I won't be stressing about filming fast enough to keep some good light. Um, and then I'm done. I'm gonna head downstairs, tap in for Grace. Steven will be coming home from work soon. He usually gets home between like 5.30 and six. And we have no plans this evening, just a fun, chill, family night. Grace and I are chilling on the couch eating some goldfish and I just got off the phone with my cousin. Is he your cousin? My cousin Lexi. I see Bessie. Yeah, you remember? What's Lexi doing tonight? I don't know. She's gonna come over for a sleepover. With Alex? With Alec, yeah. Okay. Alex is going to come here. So yeah, my, my cousin just called me. Her apartment flooded. So uh, they are packing things up and heading over here. They're packing up. They are packing up and they're going to stay with us while they get their apartment figured out. Why? Well, because everything in their whole apartment is wet. That's what flooded means. Lexi's, sleep in my Lexi's not going to sleep in your room. No, she's going to sleep upstairs. We're going to set up the bed for her. And, and Alex? And Alec, yeah. But that's very nice of you to offer to share your room. All right, it is about seven o'clock now. Is this an okay angle? Got the camera on a pillow. If I can lay down and vlog, that's pretty great. Especially like lay on my side and vlog like this since I 
can't lay on my back anymore. But it, uh, Stephen got home from work a little bit ago, so we had dinner, had some family time, and then Grace was asking him if they could play what she calls the Mickey Mouse game tonight. It's like their, the Disneyland PlayStation game that they play together. So they went upstairs a little bit ago for that, and I was uh, happy to sit this one out and just have a minute to chill. When they come back down, um, I'm gonna do Grace's bath time and get her ready for bed. And Steven's gonna set up the guest room for my cousin. They're gonna be here, she said, around 8.30. But yeah, I'm happy to just uh, have a little moment to myself here. Got the dogs cuddled up. And uh, reading away on the Kindle, I am very much still obsessed. Oh! not related at all to what I was just talking about, but I just remembered the other thing I wanted to talk about on the vlog. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to do my glucose test, which is uh, a test that you do right before your third trimester in pregnancy for gestational diabetes. And it's like, they draw your blood, you drink this really sweet sugary drink, and then they draw it again after to like see how you're affected by it. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. Last time, if I remember correctly, I think I vlogged the last time, Maybe I should go back and watch it. But if I remember correctly, the drink was not as bad as I expected. A lot of people say it makes them really nauseous. It makes them really shaky. So I was kind of nervous about that. But last time, I, I don't think I was really affected by it. But with my nausea, you know, being a little more present still at this stage in pregnancy this time, a little more nervous about how it's going to affect me. And it like potentially, you know, ruining my day, the rest of my day tomorrow. And I'm hoping to have a, a fun rest of the day with Grace after my test. I'm going and doing it in the morning. You can't eat before the test. So so I'm pretty much just gonna like wake up and go right over there and get it done. Um, and then with having PCOS, I'm at a elevated risk for gestational diabetes, which is what this test is for. So, you know, some added nerves there and, and just wanting everything to be okay. I, I didn't have it last time in my pregnancy with Grace, but every pregnancy is different. So yeah, I mean, either way, answers are good. It's always good to know. Um, and also they're gonna do some extra tests when I get the blood work done um, because my doctor is concerned that I might be anemic just with the way I was describing like how tired I've been to her and how sluggish I've been feeling. And anemia is, is really common in pregnancy. So they're just gonna test my iron levels as well and a couple other things and just see if there's anything else at play. It could also just very very well be that I'm pregnant and tired and have a toddler. I'm kind of assuming that's what it is, but you know, my doctor suggested doing the extra tests and I think, you know, more information is always better. So it'll be good to take a look at that. Um, but yeah, got that going on tomorrow. So I'm, I'm planning on going to bed really early tonight, um, which I mean, I literally always go to bed early now. <laughs> Gone are the days of like putting Grace to bed and, and having some me time and then having some time for Steven and I to hang out and watch a show. Like pretty much now it's like Grace goes to bed and I'm also going to bed. Sometimes Steven and I lay in bed and like talk for a couple minutes and watch TikToks and that's that's about it. By that point, my eyes are closing. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's what I've got going on tomorrow. Some pregnancy testing. It's crazy that I'm like almost in my third trimester. <laughs> and now I'm going back to my Kindle. I'm gonna see, see if I can squeeze in a little more reading before Steven and Grace come back downstairs. Oh my gosh, this is Nutmeg. You wanna be in the vlog, Nutmeg? Oh my goodness. You are so sweet. Is that your new friend? Uh, that's a cool. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, throw it for her. Say here, Poppy. Hey, Poppy. Here, Poppy. <laughs> <sighs> oh my goodness. <laughs> We just got Grace to bed and it was just kind of a crazy whirlwind of an evening with Lexi and Alec coming over and Yeah, it was fun. Seeing though. their dogs. It was like, you know, I no. think they're going through the the stress of it all, so yeah. it was cute seeing Grace with the little puppy, so she was so good. I feel like <laughs> really in the past couple months, Grace has like gotten really, really good with Bella where they have like a really special relationship. Bruiser still kind of keeps her distance, but like yeah. Grace is really good at being gentle with the dogs and her and Bella are very bonded. And so being around like two other dogs yeah. that are pretty social, especially the little puppy Nutmeg, Grace was like yeah, on cloud nine. <laughs> Also, tomorrow I am definitely tackling this beard. <laughs> this is like, I don't even know if the camera can like capture its <laughs> scrappiness. I don't think it's bad. I think it just needs a little trim. So I'll do that tomorrow morning before I go. Another day. Yep, I've got my glucose test tomorrow. Yeah. I was talking a little bit about that earlier. I'm like more nervous this time that it's gonna like wreck my body because I've been more nauseous. Like the drink specifically. Like I'm a little nervous for the test just in that, you know, gestational yeah. diabetes is another thing to consider and PCOS and yeah. all of that. Yeah. But yeah. I'm also like nervous for just the actual drink and it making my day tomorrow miserable. Yeah. <sighs>
I'm so tired. Me too. Let's go to bed. Yeah. All right. Good night. Good Thanks night. for watching. Mm -hmm.